Hello, my name is Eric Cutter, Managing Director of Alegria Fresh. What you're looking at is Alegria's newest socks farm, a joint venture between Alegria Fresh, Orange County Produce, and Filtrex Corporation. The new demonstration farm is 8,500 square feet, which is approximately one-fifth of an acre. We're growing over 13,000 plants in this one-fifth acre, and we're only using about one-tenth of the space to grow in. So if you extrapolate that out, that equals about 130,000 plants per acre. That's approximately three to four times more plants per acre than you get in conventional farming. We're growing 15 different cultivars of plants using the same nutritional protocols, which is pretty rare. And that allows for us basically to create this amazing micro farm salad bar. And our, our vision is, is that we take these farms and we attach a juice bar and a small farm stand to them allowing us to sell produce direct. That allows for job creation and a revenue stream that is sufficient to support the farming operations without outside subsidies. In other words, we can train youth and veterans to operate farms all over Southern California just like this and actually create a job in this process. Our mission at Alegria is threefold. First, we want to reconnect people with nutrient-dense fresh food. Second, we want to create jobs in urban agriculture. And third, we want to build farms all over the urban environment so that people have greater access to this superior food. We're using about 7,200 linear feet of sock material. And in that, we have 13 rows of 16 different cultivars. What's unique about this farm is we're growing so many different types of vegetables in one small area. This is radicchio, and we're in about 90 degrees right now, and you can see how hydrated these, these socks are staying. They're not only staying hydrated, and the temperature is very consistent because it's quite insulated, but they're also staying, they also are in a very breathable medium, and so oxygen and, hum and moisture are the two things that plants need, along with cool root temperatures, and these socks promote that. Here's a good example of how you can grow edible crops in these socks. There's three lines of socks here along the swale, and they're also providing us some sediment remediation and some water trapping that's coming off the main part of the farm. If you rethink how you can use these socks, they can provide many functions. This swale has approximately 2,000 head of cabbage in it, so not only is it beautiful, but it's providing a lot of environmental benefits as well. Hi, I'm Craig Kalaji regional representative for Filtrex International. And today I'm here at the Great Park of Orange County and I'm standing at the very first sock farm here in Southern California. We have a wide variety of different vegetables. The nutritional value of these vegetables will be much higher than what you would normally find in a uh, produce section of your local supermarket. But even more importantly, from an environmental standpoint, not only are we utilizing the recycled organics within the community, but we're also recycling and uh, using water uh, more efficiently. There's about a 70% reduction in the amount of water required to grow these crops, and about a 50% reduction in the amount of fertilizer because of the rich growing media that we're growing in. This controlled growing environment assures production of superior nutrient-dense food, higher yields, faster growth rates, and we're seeing greater pest resistance. The plants are stronger and the root zones are more consistent, thereby creating less stress on the plants. I feel very fortunate to be in partnership with A.G. Kawamura, the Ex-Secretary of Agriculture for California. His mission and mine are very similar in that we are looking to create a paradigm shift in urban agriculture. Imagine thousands of small micro farms spread throughout Southern California run by youth and veterans where we can grow California's specialty crops and actually find local markets and direct markets. I also thank the City of Irvine and the Great Park Corporation for allowing us to build this farm at the Great Park in Orange County. We are very happy to be part of this vision. I invite you to come visit us at the Great Park in Irvine, California to see for yourself how we're taking urban farming to a whole new level.